this is essentially a video to show you how to make a portable laparoscopic simulator. So these are the main items you're going to need to make this instrument. Um, some borrowed trocar, some string, skirt hanger, ideally with a adjustable clippers, a hacksaw, a pair of scissors and a standard webcam. An HD one is better. Now the first thing you're going to be doing is you're going to be removing the hook from the skirt hanger. We use that just by doing the hacksaw across there. And that will leave you with something looking a little bit like this. So you can put out the hook. Next step is take a bit of And what you're going to be doing is cutting two lengths of it so that you can lash the trocars to the top part of the pre-cut skirt hanger. And the way I found it's easiest to do this is just to tie a knot to anchor it at either end. You don't want to be too tight because you want to be able to move it left and right. And then just using a figure of eight, lash the trocar into the skirt hanger. And just tie a knot to fix it. You'll want to do this at both ends so that you have two true cars. Now, to actually use it, just any old laptop, attach your pre prepared skirt hanger lashed on trocars to the top of it and launch a video application. I've used QuickTime here. The webcam just clips on at the top and you can adjust it later so that it's looking in the direction that you want. The advantage of using QuickTime is that it's very easy to come across, it's free and you can record your videos as well. And now you can use your portable laparoscopic simulator to practice dexterity, tasks, knot tying, wherever you desire. That's pretty much it.